Liberal Democrat Maxine Waters is practically a California institution. The almost 80-year-old politician has been serving since 1991, enacting more and more liberal policies on California, and it seems that there has never been a challenger capable of taking her down. But is that about to change? Newcomer Omar Navarro is a conservative Latino politician, and he's officially looking to send Waters packing once and for all. The 28-year-old rising star said that he's had enough of seeing Waters and her liberal agenda destroy his state, and he's hoping to take her seat in the 43rd Congressional District in the 2018 elections. When I realized Maxine Waters was my representative, I said, wow, this person is representing me. How are people electing this person year after year? Navarro said in an interview with Breitbart. I started doing research and looking into her background and I did not see one candidate running a legitimate campaign against her in 27 years. John Hawkins' book 101 Things All Young Adults Should Know is filled with lessons that newly minted adults need in order to get the most out of life. Gleaned from a lifetime of trial, error, and writing it down, Hawkins provides advice everyone can benefit from in short, digestible chapters. By now he added that he is tired of liberal politicians that are running their own districts, their own counties down to the ground. Enough is enough, and that he wants to run in 2018 because we have to do something about it and I'm not going to let our country fall apart. The 43rd District, where Navarro is running, includes parts of South Central LA, Westchester, Playa del Rey, Torrance, Gardena, Hawthorne, Inglewood and Lundale. He was born in Inglewood and raised in Hawthorne and Torrance, which he says gives him an edge because he knows the district and its people. He previously served on the Traffic Commission in Torrance. Navarro previously ran against Waters in 2016, but only raised about $3,000 for his election. Waters was able to raise $650,000, which she spent to keep her seat. But I still got 25% of the vote, which was quite humbling to even receive that type of vote with the amount of money I spent, he said. I learned a lot from that election. So far, Navarro has outraised Waters, and he's ready to make a change for the better. I want to run. I want to make a difference in my community. I want to impact my community. I'm tired of all of these politicians not doing anything for us they're not changing anything. I want to be that person. Do you support Omar Navarro?